Welcome to Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, also known as the Cultural Cradle of Canada, Gateway to the West, The Peg, or Winter Peg. This video will provide 15 reasons why people love Winnipeg. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to Winnipeg, Manitoba. Population of about 750,000 smack dab on the Trans-Canada Highway. Now just for context, we have a map here. We have circled Winnipeg. Winnipeg is two hours from the Ontario border, one hour from the American border, one hour from Portage La Prairie, and two and a half hours from Brandon. Now this video will provide 15 reasons why people love Winnipeg. People love Winnipeg because of the Forks, a year-round destination for locals and tourists. The Forks is the place to visit in winter or summer with indoor and outdoor activities. Located where the Red and Assiniboine Rivers join, the Forks is a shopping and entertainment district set in a number of historic buildings. The site was once a railway repair facility and over the years the various buildings have been meticulously restored to house a mix of interesting shops, restaurants and museums. People love Winnipeg because of the Assiniboine Park and Zoo. Winnipeg's oldest park, Assiniboine, encompasses 445 hectares of grassy lawns, mature trees, cultural facilities, and an English garden. The Assiniboine Park Zoo is located within its grounds and is home to a variety of animals, flora, and fauna. Special emphasis is given to creatures of the northern latitudes, including a significant number of polar bears, though there are also some exotic species such as the Siberian tigers and red kangaroos. Another attraction in the park is the Leo Mole Sculptural Garden. People love Winnipeg because of the Manitoba Museum. It is primarily devoted to the human and natural history of the province. The nine permanent galleries showcase the best of what the province has to offer and the highly interactive science gallery and planetarium introduces the vastness of the night sky on its dome screen. Highlights of the museum include a 95 million year old fossil, a display that recreates the northern lights, and a recreated Hudson Bay fur trading post. People love Winnipeg because of the Royal Canadian Mint. It produces coins not just for Canada, but for a number of other countries as well. In fact, over 55 billion coins have been produced there. You can follow the whole minting process in the recently renovated tour area. Interactive displays show how coins are manufactured from start to finish. People love Winnipeg because of the Manitoba Legislative Building. Built on local Tyndall stone and Italian marble, the magnificent neoclassical legislative building in Winnipeg was completed in 1919. Unique features of the building include hidden hieroglyphics, Freemason symbols, and secret numerical codes. Tours are offered weekly and are led by an architectural historian. People love Winnipeg because of the Canadian Museum for Human Rights. This recent addition to Winnipeg's cultural scene has become the city's state-of-the-art landmark, reflecting human rights in Canada and around the world. The museum is known both for its spectacular building design and its unique concept in presenting human rights stories. You enter the museum at the ground floor and ascend over six levels visiting 11 galleries along the way. It has proved controversial in many ways but in no doubt an important Canadian cultural institution. People love Winnipeg because of the Winnipeg Art Gallery. Housed in a very modern building shaped like the bow of a ship, the Winnipeg Art Gallery possesses 25,000 pieces spread across collections of classic and contemporary art by Canadian, American, European and Inuit artists. The Winnipeg Art Gallery is Western Canada's oldest gallery and frequently hosts events and a wide range of artists from poets to jazz musicians. People love Winnipeg because of the Exchange District. Turn of the century Victorian and Edwardian commercial architecture defines Winnipeg's Exchange District. Its name a reflection of the many financial institutions that sprung up in Winnipeg between the 1880s and 1920s. More recently, the Exchange District has seen a revival with old warehouses, bank and business premises being converted into fashion boutiques, 
upmarket shops, art galleries, and restaurants. Old Market Square is the unofficial heart of the area and the site of various events and festivals in the summer months. People love Winnipeg because of Fort White Alive. Spread over 259 hectares, it's known for its five lakes, grassy parkland, and bog boardwalks. The Interpretive Center is home to an aquarium and nature exhibits including burrowing owls. Outdoors, visitors can watch the bison herd, visit the bird feeding station, see the sod house, or watch the antics of the prairie dogs at the prairie dog town. People love Winnipeg because of the Thermaea Spa. The newest jewel in Winnipeg's luxuriant spa crown, Thermaea brings a bit of Scandinavia to the heart of Canada. Let the stress soak out of you in Thermopur situated amongst the pines. Indulge your senses in Finnish saunas. Treat yourself to the best in body treatments and massage therapy. Then finish your day with some exquisite dining. People love Winnipeg because of their sports team. The Winnipeg Blue Bombers are a professional Canadian football team and they are the current Grey Cup champions. The Blue Bombers compete in the Canadian Football League as a member of the league's West Division. And then there's the Winnipeg Jets. They're a professional ice hockey team. They compete in the National Hockey League as a member of the North Division. People love Winnipeg because of the Manitoba Children's Museum. It is housed in a state-of-the-art facility located at the Forks. Inside this unique building, you'll find 12 interactive permanent galleries which will appeal to children of all ages. The galleries range from the milk machine, featuring a giant cow cube you can actually go inside, to the engine house, where kids can find a multitude of gears and levers to pull. Also is the lasagna lookout, where your kids are allowed to play with their food. People love Winnipeg because of the St. Boniface Cathedral. It is the oldest cathedral in Western Canada, founded in 1818. Set in a pleasant park, the cemetery is Western Canada's oldest Catholic burial ground. It has many old gravestones of the first settlers and key figures from days long past, including the grave of Louis Riel. The nearby St. Boniface Museum, the oldest building in Winnipeg, was constructed in 1846. People love Winnipeg because of the Riel House National Historic Site. Real House belonged to Louis Riel's family and has been restored to reflect the social, economic, and cultural realities of the life in 1886. Louis Riel was the leader of the Métis and the founder of Manitoba. He led several rebellions in 1869 and 1884. He was executed in 1885. The house in the Red River frame style is typical of the early settler homes in the Manitoba region. Riel's descendants lived in this house until 1969. People love Winnipeg because of the Festival de Voyageur. It is Winnipeg's most popular winter festival. Taking place in February, this event celebrates the traditions of the French voyageurs, the fur traders of early Canada. The festival includes entertainment and events for children and adults with the activities in French and English. Large tents are set up outside at Voyager Park and other sites in the city where you can find live music, food, dancing and more. Make sure you don't miss the stunning ice and snow sculptures, one of the highlights of the festival. The reasons provided in this video are not all the reasons why people love Winnipeg. If you've got a reason why you love Winnipeg, pop it in the comments section. I'll make another video. I hope you enjoyed the video. Ciao for now.